Hey YouTube, it's Eclipse Day and I've got my bubble sextant and I'm going to try to get some good visuals on that and uh, well, we'll see how it turns out. There's the beginning of the eclipse. You can just see the sun. I'm sorry, you can just see the moon in the right side of the sun there. I hope you can see that. It's difficult to keep everything all lined up. I've got the sextant on a tripod and the camera on a tripod, but the camera touches the sextant and it moves. So I adjust everything and of course the sun is moving constantly. But uh, when I set this up, everything was centered. <laughs> it's close, but it, I think it's moving off to the side there. It's right around local noon now within a few minutes either side of it. And the good thing is that means the sun is not going up or down very much at the moment. And uh, I'm able to get a fairly steady shot. That will change as the day progresses and we have uh, less than an hour till the totality of it occurs in this area, the maximum coverage in this area. So the sun will probably be moving a little bit faster then. Well, I think my sextant, my bubble chamber, has sprung a leak. Uh, what should be happening, it's been out in the sun for 45 or 50 minutes now, what should be happening is that the, the bubble should be getting smaller. As the fluid warms up, it has nowhere to expand, so what it does is it squeezes down the bubble and reabsorbs it. But what's happening is there's a series of small little bubbles coming up from the lower right in the chamber there. I don't know if it's visible in the camera. I've blacked out the bubble chamber, so that's not visible right now. It's still sunny out, but you can tell the sun is, uh, the light levels are lower. But I don't know if you would actually notice it that much if you were just out and didn't know there was an eclipse going on. It was about 86 degrees Fahrenheit when I came out here. Now we're close to the maximum uh, extent of the solar eclipse today. And you could probably see the temperature has dropped, frost is forming on everything, the plants are starting to die. No, none of that is happening. That's only in the moon. It's still 86 degrees out. And it's still pretty bright out. We're about five minutes from the peak. And uh, you can tell that we're close. We're not going to get total a total eclipse here. That's about the peak right there. Try to view it with the bubble chamber blacked out, so you just see the uh, the sun there. That little sliver. Of it. Well, there we have it. Solar eclipse, August 2017.